tragedy in Warwick, Rhode Island in February 2003 served as a sober reminder of inherent dangers in public assembly occupancies. While there were many factors contributing to this disaster, the proper placement of fire extinguishers and the presence of personnel trained in their use during pyrotechnics as required in NFPA 1126 could possibly have made a difference in fighting the fire in the early stages. The Fire Equipment Manufacturers Association, FEMA, conducted a live fire test using the same type of foam material that was present at the station nightclub in Rhode Island. Easily ignited, the foam material went up in flames and the fire spread with great speed. But most importantly, the fire is extinguished quickly and efficiently using a common ABC dry chemical fire extinguisher. When fires are extinguished in the early stages, loss of life is minimal. 93% of all fire-related deaths occur once the fire has progressed beyond the early stages. Direct property damage is minimal. 95% of all direct property damage occurs once the fire has progressed beyond the early stages. It's critical to improve fire protection by including portable fire extinguishers as a first line of defense in all commercial structures. It just makes good life safety sense.